Well, from retail to research, an empty mall in West L.A. will be transformed into a groundbreaking research and innovation hub. The new plans announced today by Governor Newsom and UCLA. And the school purchased the Westside Pavilion on Pico Boulevard. KCAL News reporter Jeff Nguyen spoke, uh, has more about the plans and the hefty price tag for the project. Around the intersection of Westwood and Pico Boulevards in West L.A., you'll notice there are plenty of empty storefronts. They all surround Nas Renau's salon. Shoes shop is close to coffee bean, Starbucks, and uh, pie apple is the close. She sits right across the street from the old West Side Pavilion. Most of it closed in 2018. Google was supposed to turn it into office space, but the pandemic ended all of that. On Wednesday, UCLA announced it bought the 700,000 square foot complex. The plan turned it into a research park that will house a new Institute of Immunology and Immunotherapy. The Institute will put Los Angeles and California at the forefront of these emerging fields, which are reshaping medicine and helping us better fight cancer and other range of diseases. Financial support comes from Governor Gavin Newsom and the state legislature, along with private donations. The work that will be done will be similar to what the world witnessed during the pandemic. Immunology in the form of mRNA vaccines literally saved the world. We all became familiar with the fundamentals of immunology. Restaurant owner Steve Walters is hoping future workers will cross the street to sample his menu. If we do really good taste and really, you know, really good food, I believe the dinner, it could be track them to come at the dinner time. That's the old Landmark Theater, which closed in May of last year. The owner of the salon says that visibility from the theater was everything. Everyone coming, I ask everyone, how you find me? I was in the theater and I see you, I'm coming. UCLA says quantum science and engineering will be done here as well. The governor expects the research park will be up and running in more than five years from now. In West LA, Jeff Nguyen, KCAL News.